Hello to all of you, this is Dr. Tawal Mehta and today we are going to discuss about installing R and R Studio on your system. So for this purpose, let's directly go on Google and we'll write down downloading R CRAN, C-R-A-N CRAN. The first link which, we, which is generated, click on it and it will give you an option of depending upon your operating system, you will have to choose Windows, Macintosh or Linux. My system is Windows and therefore I'll click on it. Now I'll go in the base package. So again, depending upon your system, it is a 32-bit or 64-bit, you will have to choose the option. When I'll click on it, you can see on left-hand side, the exe file will start downloading. Let it get download. We will go for installing RStudio. Now again, I'll go back in Google. And now this time I'll write downloading RStudio. The first link which is generated, click on it. You can scroll a bit, scroll a little. The free one, you have to click on the free one, download it. This will also give me the exe file. You will have to click here, download R Studios, right? And it will take some time because it's a big file. Once this is done, that is, you have installed exe file of R and as well as R Studio, you will have to run this, both these files, right? So for example, I'll go in downloads and see I'm having a exe file, this one. So I'll run this exe file of R as well as R Studio. Now, once this is done, when I will activate R from my system, I'll have to go here and I'll have to all apps. I'll have to go here in R. Just a minute. Yeah. From here, I can activate R. Now, this is a base, base package. That is R console. We are not going to work here, but we require this program then only uh, the R Studio will work, right? So when we will click on this R Studio, I'll get this icon. You'll have to activate this and now I'll get R Studio. Normally, we require four windows, but at present, say for example, if you are able only able to see three windows, then what you will do? You will have to click here and click on R Script. We are always going to work in R script because we can save the things, save our work in R script. Here, the output will be generated. This is our console. Here, it is a temporary memory. We are not going to work here. Here, plots will be generated. And here, the environment, that is, the information related to the variables will be generated. So, thank you all of you. This is all, all about installing R and R Studio. You can find all the codes related to R and R Studio in my book which is published on amazon.in as well as amazon.com that is data analysis using r by dr dawal mehta you can follow me on linkedin and twitter and you can kindly subscribe to my channel